Avery, I'm Avatar, known as Tao Chikai. Oh, me the four. Um, and I'm here on the You Know Mad Char uh, Barber's channel. Uh, last episode, uh, we had you lying face down, isn't it? So today, we're going to get you to lie face up. Uh, lower lumbar, but lower back problems. We worked on the glutes last time. Did a nice correction on, on the thoracic. So now we're going to flip around, work on more on the, on the pelvis and stuff. It's going to all time with like the core. As you said, low, if you've got lower back problems, it's going to be time with the core as well. Mm. Loose up the core, then hopefully you'll get more energy flowing through there. Maybe do some corrections on the neck. Uh, let's see, see how we go from there. So I hope you guys enjoy. Subscribe to Norma Barber and let's get on this. Right, bro, would you lie on your back now? Yes. There you go. Yeah, you guys know it's like, Matt, if you come up here, you can see. See, like Miguel's shoulders right now, they're not touching the floor. You see that? There's a, come, like a gap here, it really should be like here. But at the moment, he's kind of bowled forward here. Hopefully, we could sort that out. And also, if you're looking from here, his shoulders are kind of like all hunched in. But let um, me see. All right, bro. So that feels more comfortable now, isn't it? Yeah. Your back feels more flat on the ground like this. So yeah, so at the moment your hips are kind of like bold like this. Okay, take a jet breath. Let me push it out. Breath again. Good. It helped to lengthen out the lower back, but also start to engage the stomach here, the abdominal. There you go. Yeah, it's kind of twisted. Right, breathe into my hands. And relax. Breathe into the hands. Yeah, so the moment Miguel's shoulders and hips are kind of bowed forward. It's quite a common thing, you know, get a lot of people like this. That's it, breathing into the hands. So I'm using the out breath here just to really encourage a bit more movement but also helping him to settle a bit further into the ground. Miguel, you're going to take a gentle breath in. When the breath goes, really allow your legs to open, yeah? Really open. There we go. So what is the adductors get really tight? And the abductors as well, so over here, it's going to help just to relax them. Get the pelvis bit to be more square. Allow the hips to open more. You do this, you find that your shoulders will start relaxing as well. 
the more we can loosen up the pelvis and the sacrum, uh, the neck will start to feel more released as well. At the moment, I can definitely see that Miguel's neck's being pulled to one side. back. Can wait for breath coming in. When the breath goes, I want to introduce these little ripples now. Just sending ripples up the spine from the sacrum up the lower back, up towards the mid chest, up towards the neck and then through the head, sending these ripples Go. I'll just keep this up for a bit just so that his physiology can get used to this movement. But what we're doing here is helping just to relax the internal organs. You know, if you sit down the whole day, everything gets crunched in. And organs are you know, muscles at the end of the day. It's just good to relax it. The more we can relax it, the spine will have more movement as well. to engage the ribs. Okay, and wait for the out breath again. I'm going to introduce some new movement. We're going to start to rock there. Waiting for the in breath, out breath. I'm going to wait for a little rock. Just reintroducing all these natural movements that the, the pelvis can accommodate. But at the same time, reintroducing this torsion. There we go. Now I'm just going to continue doing this movement. There you go. You think your, your neck just releases there. <laughs> Good. Give the lower back a nice stretch now. Nice breath. There you go. Breathing nice and deep. And each time the breath goes, let your spine sink in. managed to lengthen the lower back now. It was in the beginning, it was quite difficult for Miguel to kind of lie on his back list without us lifting the knees up. Working on the course, relaxing the innards a bit more. Holding onto the glutes, rocking the pelvis. 
encourage more movement here, holding on to the shoulder, rocking the pelvis. Nice breath. Let go. Do the same to the other side. Good. There. That really helps to stretch the psoas on either side. Okay, let's go back towards the shoulders now. Breathing into my hands. So now you notice now from beginning to now the shoulders are a bit more towards the ground. They're less bold forward. Gonna rotate the shoulder. There's a bit of impingement here. There's a bolt here, a socket, holding onto the ball and socket, rotating the whole of this limb here, just to help the bone just to settle a bit more into that socket. See, his shoulders are now touching ground more. Work towards the neck now. Get into the traps. Wow, yeah, Miguel's neck's pretty compressed. Let's work into this neck here. Over the Relax his muscles as much as we can. Get into the traps. Nice breath. Good, just breathe into that, bro. That's it. Loosen his neck as much as we can when I make a little correction now.
potential. Pulling onto the whole spine, just giving a little bit of movement here. Just gently. Yeah. His neck's pretty compressed. I'm starting to loosen up a bit more. back down towards the low end. Little stretch. Do another stretch on the lower back. Nice breath. Yeah. Easy this time, yeah? Here we go. Just breathe into that, bro. Loosen the tail up. And then I can make that adjustment with the neck. So the tail in the beginning was like that. So we just kind of like help it just to loosen, relax it is. Because if the tail is pointing up like this, the head's gonna look down towards it. That's why you get this kind of like prawn shape, you know? So now we loosen the tail, and then now I can work more on the neck. That feels better. Okay, Max, I'm gonna make a correction here on Miguel's neck. It's kind of preps now, it's a bit more looser now, it's more space to work with. Just turn it around. Ooh, relax, relax. Here, yeah, nice breath. Yeah. Nice one inside. Just let the blood flow. This side, nice breath. There. So both times on the right side. And then now the shoulders are the shoulders are completely on the floor now. And very comfortably as well. Just relaxed on the sh floor. Help more the shoulders now. Good. 
working the ribs just so that when the guard breathes, his ribs get expanded a bit more. And that helps his shoulders. So I tend to pat like this, but some people are ticklish, so you pat. And when they become less ticklish, that's when I start to add an effleurage or you know, a massage. So they help the shoulders. So then our stomach feels a bit more, more relaxed now as well, less tense. So you have that lower back pain, you usually find that you've got issues inside the abdominal re region, but also there'll be issues in the glutes. shoulders more but this one's a bit impinged holding on to the whole joint using the ground as leverage kind of rock the shoulder making sure we're moving the spine as well take a nice breath bro and then let go nice breath and let go He's always with the out breath. Working to the traps from this angle. There. Let's get the other side. Whoosh. You feel a stiffness, you feel it. Mm. Yeah. There you go. Get underneath. I'm using the ground as leverage here. fingers there between the spine and the scapula. Get the issues here. Holding on to the whole joint, rotating it. And every now and then you'll find a knot right there. Take a nice breath. And let go. to get to the traps. Shoulders further. Give him a hug, pull the elbows apart. Nice breathing. Just rock. Because as we do this, we can really leave it the core tension built on the shoulders, everything like that. It's going to just be held. Set a nice breath, just gentle. There. And again, just keep it up. Yeah, keep it up. So you loosen this when you're really free your neck. Swap the sides. Give them a hug. Pull the elbows away. There. Free the neck further. Yeah, 
traps feel more looser now. First two is the neck. Right, and let's help the lower back further now. I'm going to give a convex and kind of convex the spine. Gentle breath, but deep, and then let go. Gentle breath, but deep, and let go. Gentle breath, but deep, and let go. Gentle breath, but deep, and let go. And again. And again. And again. And again. That's it, keep it up. Just keep moving like that. That's it, keep it up. Okay. And then let go. So giving the shoulders opportunities to fall further back while the spine is convexed. Gentle breath, deep. And then let yourself sink. And again. And again. And again. And again. And again. <clears throat> Good. Gonna go down one step. So each time we do this, we give opportunities to work on the traps a bit more. Good, and then release. That's it, nice breath. Good, release. Nice breath. Release. Nice breath. Release. Nice breath. Making our way towards the mid back now. Shoulders are starting to drop. Clasp your hands, nice breath, release, feel the stretch in the neck, feel the stretch in the neck,
And then here we get opportunity to really work on the neck. So shoulders are brought more down now. So freeze the neck more to really help to introduce this or reintroduce this movement. Placing the feet right on the traps, pushing down. There. stretch there you go bro breathe breathe here Attempt to give a little spine the compression now. Okay, nice breath. E. There we go. So we didn't get, we didn't quite have to play up this much. We had a bit more time. Can release more. Right, I noticed early on when we was working on the front side, Miguel's ankles need a little help. That's one. Two. How you feeling, bro? Nice. <laughs> awesome. So, guys. How are you feeling, bro? <laughs> oh, amazing, man. You notice how your shoulders after a while was just like, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. It's tension, isn't it, really? I've got big guns, man. This guy's massive. Jeez Louise. Oh, sweat working this guy. <laughs> but thank you so much for inviting me onto the channel, bro. No, no, it's always, uh, always a privilege, you know? And, you know, as I say, he's the OG, man. <laughs> yeah, he's one of, the, one of the guys that started it, really. But thank you so much uh, for the views at home. Please subscribe to Nomad Barber if you want to check my channel out, Tao Chi Kai. I will link it in the description <laughs> and um, I'm going to be giving him a head massage next. So.
Amazing. Well, Good check that out. Yeah, awesome. I'm looking forward to it. But until next time, I'm the Avatar Nord Tower Chicago on Beautiful Warm.